Why don't you like the paintings? What? Because they're of naked women. Excuse me, are you still talking about the paintings? Yes. Oh, is this the whole thing with the nude modeling obsession? Yes. I swear it's to God. Sebastian, I swear to God, this guy retires after getting like $20 million, and all of a sudden he's into painting nude models. Not good for my best friend, Caitlin, who is already a little on the rocks about how the boyfriend already acts with all the money. You know so what I'm talking about? How am I about? supposed to take this shot? I mean, he's got his hair. What are you guys talking about? Uh, yeah. We're trying to figure out how to get you the, and your hair in one shot, this one steady shot. Well, I think with the spanks on that it shrinks me, so that should be an easier shot to be able to do, right? See, I, I told you to come up and with remem solution. And remember, spanks are always the solution, Michael. <laughs> but remember, it's all about the sound as well. Don't forget the sound. Oh, yeah. Very important. Nice for the frame, good for the sound. I, always I need the sound. The A lot of time, filmmakers will say, well, you know, I don't really need to worry about the sound. And it, it just becomes a bit of a... It becomes a bit of a situation, you know, uh, but it's really the most important thing because if you can't hear me, Jake? it's not good to see me. Oh, Jake, hi, Carmen. Hi. Oh, there you are. Hi. Um, I have such an idea for you. Oh, yeah? Okay, so it's a recurring segment for your show okay. where you make me a suit of bacon and then we see how dogs react to it and we test a different kind each week and see which one's best. I get the feeling that you use my show to mourn your childhood, Carly. <laughs> <laughs> I Gotta go. Bacon. There are some people in, in your life that will be jealous of you and, and, and yet they'll, they'll pretend like they like you. Uh, she's not one of those people. She just wants dogs to sniff her. That's all that she's looking for there. Uh, but it is interesting to me about different people, different psychological states of mind. You know, I tend to surround myself with the best of them. Hi, ladies. Hey, how are you? What's going on? We're just trying to, I don't know, find a way to like hip you up. Hip you up? Yeah. Hip me up? Yeah, yeah. Are you saying that I'm not quite hip? No, I mean, the kids love you more because you have the soul of a child. No, that's well, right. and I play in the sandbox like one. Well, let me ask you a question, Ma. What would you do? What would you guys do? One thing that you would do to make me hipper? I would remove yeah. everything. Apparently, they want to see me oh, naked with a flatter top you know. on the head. I don't mind the hairdo. Uh, me being naked would mm, be a problem. Speaking of problems, hello, Paul. Hello, Jake. You look shocked to see me. Why are you here? We need to talk. You know, people just always want to talk. I don't have a minute. People want to talk to me. And you know, it gets a little obnoxious because actually he claims that I owe him money. I don't know. The whole thing. People, all of a sudden you're successful in this business and people say, oh, wait a minute. You need to talk to me now because I was with you at the beginning. Wrong answer, ladies. Do they know whether or not it exists and the reality? What they exists? Want to know the show, the episodes, the characters, the breakdown. I'm not sure I want to execute. She we thinks people don't have faith in it. We want but a solutions based approach. We've got a lot of great people. Listen, I love solutions. Who's solutions. not believing? People believe. This is a believable. Well, believing and finding a solution are two <laughs> horses of another color. Ironic that friend. the two skinniest girls on the, on the show are by the craft table. Does it taste like a pet cat? Ironic. It, it doesn't taste like a bank cap. No. I haven't eaten plastic for weeks. Is that right? For weeks. It's not healthy for you. I don't know if that's people get so know. nervous. Ha! I don't understand how people can get nervous. I mean, because if you don't, the state of overwhelm is not a conducive state to be able to solve problems. Because you can't solve a problem on the same level with which it was created. I gotta tell you, the cookie from the craft service table, not bad. Mm. Hey, oh, that, Marty. Hi, I've got that contract for you for the second season. Really? The ratings are great, so don't worry about it. I've got it. I'll send it right over You're to you. You're taking care of it? I'm taking care of Just it. Marty's got it. Marty's got it. The lawyer always gets it. The lawyer's on top of her business most of the time. Or she has what she tells me anyways. Jake! Oh! Hey, will you What's take us to set for me? You're making me do something for you? Please. Brittany! You're so cute. Can you go flush my toilet, please? Yeah, a uh, small button or big button? You're the big button today, please. Bye. So anyways, this is a little bit Jake! of how things run. Hey! Uh, okay. Oh, Cruise. You great. Like, what are you sure doing, Cruz? Oh, oh, look at Jake. that. Yeah. Jake! Oh, you look so good. Are you uh, excited about your show? It's so I'm very great. excited. No, I'm there's, very... Just, there's a lot going on. Oh my god, we're so nervous. Stop it. And I couldn't do it without you. Oh, oh, we're so happy to be here. We're so here. happy to work for you. Thank you, Chris. We love you, Jakey. Thank you, Franklin. You're the best. You know, whenever I meet them, I realize I'm not so manic after all, and I'm not really the one who needs medication. Anyways, welcome to the Teen Talk studio for Teen Talk. Oh, and this is the hey, show. Hey, we've got oh. some great ideas for new episodes. Listen to this. Yeah? Listen to this. Siamese tweens. Oh. Friend or foe? Yeah. I don't know any Siamese twins, i got to tell you. Yeah. Oh, well, it's a great Let's episode. book them. Will you yeah. book them? Yeah, yeah. We book them. Well, done deal, yeah. man. This is the set. This is where it all goes down. These are the people that you just saw that make it go down. And you know, every now and again, I have a nightmare. And I wake up, and I realize, gosh, I have a lot going on in my life. But I created it in my head. Oh.